A Pythagorean triple is a set of three positive integers that satisfy the Pythagorean theorem equation a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Every right triangle satisfies this equation, but not every right triangle satisfies this equation where all three numbers are integers. The simplest Pythagorean triple having the lowest integers is 3, 4, and 5 because 3 squared plus 4 squared equals 5 squared, or 9 plus 16 equals 25. If we scale up a Pythagorean triple by an integer multiple, then the new larger triangle will be similar to the initial right triangle. Remember, corresponding sides of similar triangles are proportional. The larger triangle will also be comprised of Pythagorean triples. Here are some more Pythagorean triples. I don't think you need to have any of these memorized except 3, 4, 5 and its double 6, 8, 10 because triangles with these side lengths are handy for identifying or constructing right angles as the next two applications show. Application number 3 of the Pythagorean theorem is checking a corner for square, which is determining whether or not an angle is 90 degrees. Here we're shown the top view of a fence and we want to know if the corner is 90 degrees. Using a 345 Pythagorean triple, we measure out 3 and 4 feet along the sides, then measure between these endpoints and compare the length to 5 feet. If it's exactly 5 feet, then the corner is square. If greater than 5 feet, then the corner is obtuse. If less than 5 feet, then the corner is acute. In the next video clip, Two carpenters do this as part of their craft. So we'll begin by Joe and I checking this building for square. You pull out six foot, I'll pull out eight foot. We're using a standard six, eight, and ten check to make sure the block layers left us with a 90 degree corner. Now if they didn't, we'll have to adjust the sill in or out a bit to compensate. Looks great, Joe. It's right on ten foot. Since their measured hypotenuse was exactly 10 feet, they knew the corner was perfectly square. The fourth application of the Pythagorean theorem is very similar to number three. We can use a Pythagorean triple to construct a right angle. In this video clip, a gardener wants to create a square corner in her garden. And that distance should equal five feet. If it's more or less, you might need to move one of those points. Um, to make sure that that hypotenuse is five feet. So here we have three, four, and five, and therefore we know that this is a square corner. Adjusting the angle between the three and four sides until the hypotenuse is five will result in a right angle. She even uses the word hypotenuse. The supplemental video to this lecture, TR-10X, includes drills and practice problems. The next video, TR-11, covers another application for the Pythagorean theorem, determining the distance between two points.